Suzanne here, blog post number two. Woo! Um, I'm standing here in my studio. Let me show you. Um, as you can see, it still needs a lot of work. I'm, what I'm trying to do is peel the fake, this fake stucco stuff off the wall. Um, because these are nice plaster walls, they just need to be patched up. But I got a little distracted uh, working on my web page, so um, hopefully I can get back to that soon. This, there's actually uh, not a lot that needs to be done, and then I'm just gonna um, throw some paint up, uh, get some more lighting in here, and move all my stuff in. It's not very big, but um, what I like about having a studio in my house is that I can spread out through my house, which I like to do, and make art more like a piece of my life. But anyway, what I'm doing today is there's a abandoned warehouse in my neighborhood. It's been abandoned for years, and for some reason the door is wide open. So I'm gonna see if I can go in, uh, grab some photos. Hopefully there's some good graffiti in there. Um, not sure what the state of the place is. I've got my good, you know, boots. Actually, monkey boots, if any of you were around in the 80s, know what monkey boots are. I've got my good monkey boots on that I just have loved for decades. And some pepper spray, because you never know. I don't know. I've never had problems before, um, but better, what is it? What is it? Um, better to need it, better to not need it and have it than have it and not need it. I don't know if I said that right. Anyway, you get the idea. Uh, better safe than sorry. How about that? Uh, oh, I'm bringing a friend too, just, uh, you know, for safety. I don't really know if there's people in there. I have run into people living in warehouses before and they just pretty much wanted to be left alone was the main thing. So, but you never know. Um, if I get some good standalone photos that I can just, um, you know, post up without doing much editing, I'll get those up on here too. And then hopefully I'll get some material that I can make into finished photos. So, um, stay tuned.